Have a look at this spot, would you? Absolutely stunning. It's a hard life, but someone has to do it. Well, g'day there, guys. Mr. Oz Adventure here. How good is this spot? Isn't it a nice spot? To be broken down! I'm not sure if you can see this big black strip here, but this big black strip is all the oil that has come out of my motorbike. I come around that corner there, accelerated, and then bang, lost all power, rolled up here. Come to a stop here to find oil all over the back tyre, all over the underneath of my bike. The chain has come off both sprockets. Look, it's just floating around there. It's come off the rear sprocket. It's come off the front sprocket. It's just kicking around loosely oil everywhere underneath the engine there I don't know if you can see that very well it's uh, the whole bash plate under there is just full of oil it's all dripped out into the grass and half out the bloody road of course and also this pin in here has sheared off and bent I don't know what it is but it's, it's serious it's broken and it's bent and it's come off my motorbike and there's oil everywhere so I really don't know what's going on there I will I have to get it home and have a look. It's a massive pain in the ass. I was heading down to Lismore to Captain Cranky's house to go riding with him tomorrow. I was going to stay there tonight and have a good few drinks and uh, catch up and run over some stuff and uh, have a bit of a good time. I'm going to go for a ride tomorrow up the Bruxton Highway, but obviously that is not going to ha be happening now and I am not going to be riding this bad boy for quite some time. I'm pretty broke at the moment. I don't have a lot of money. The debts are mounting up and now I have a broken motorcycle on top of that. So I don't know how long it's going to be before I ride again, but I will keep you updated. And I still have lots of footage to bring you lots of videos regularly in the meantime. But uh, I'll, do, I'll do a repair video and show you what is actually going on there. I don't know at this stage what the problem is, but... Hopefully it's not too bad. Hopefully it's not like a, a cracked engine casing or anything that's made the oil piss out. Hopefully it's just a seal or something like that. I don't know what's caused the chain to come off, whether the oil came first, which made the chain come off, whether the sprockets have moved. I really don't know what the hell is going on. There's a little bit of damage I can see in there. I'm not going to pick it up. The chain has scraped against uh, one of the engine mounting areas. But, uh, I don't know if the chain will be any good. It's probably been slapping around. I might have to get a new chain and new sprockets I'd say. Just to be on the safe side. I don't know. I'm not going to know the damage until I get into it. But uh, Fuck it! That's, I didn't need that. I did not need that at all. <sighs> anyway, I'll just keep hanging out here. In the sunshine. On the side of the road in the countryside. Just chilling out, waiting for my lift home. I rang roadside assist and they couldn't really help me. They could just tow me to the nearest town for free, uh, which is pretty pointless. I'm just going to be stuck in, in the nearest town then. It's a long weekend, start of a long weekend. Saturday afternoon, nothing's open until Tuesday anywhere. So the tow truck driver said that they couldn't tow me up to the Gold Coast until Tuesday. Fat lot of good that is. I'm still stuck here on the side of the road until then. Not going to happen. So, yeah, a mate is coming to rescue me with a trailer. We're going to have to try and get this heavy pig of a thing into his trailer. I don't know how we're going to do that. And uh, tie it down somehow. All right, I'll let you know how I go. Keep you updated. Bye.